You know, the NS theory has really been a work in progress. It really started out where um, I was just doing um, the NASCAR Racing 2003 demo, doing series for that. Uh, I then ended up upgrading that to the Bullring 2011 cars, and then I was able to find the full version. Uh, as far as I'm aware, uh, it, it pretty much took off from there, and since then I've been able to uh, do pretty well in that. Uh, I did end up having a Snickers Cup series before the NSRA even got started, and then when I saw how uh, the MFNPRA and all those different uh, groups were getting together, I thought, well, why don't I end up making a thing for myself, and um, I decided to do it, uh, the NNSCRA, which actually means the NASCAR Nelliston Stock Car Racing Association, and so uh, did that, and then I thought, okay, let's try and do what the MFNPRA is doing and add in more members, and so uh, obviously we've had Robert Band, we've had in, uh, uh, Trent Dunham, we've got Matthew Rodriguez, we've got Dougie Shears, we've got, um, uh, I know I'm missing one there, Sean Henley, and, uh, so, and if I missed anybody else, I apologize, but, uh, that, that's how it started getting on, and then we ended up moving into season two, and so things just got even better, then we decided that we'd put out our own website, and that's just gotten even better there, so, yeah, it's been a work in progress, but, uh, for the most part, the end of the series has just been a, a, a process of things building up, and uh, I think we've got a great organization. I'm hoping that we're going to stick around for quite a long time. People seem to enjoy it, and uh, so pretty much that's how the NSRA got started, with just uh, a few races here, a few races there, and then finally we ended up coming up with, hey, let's try an organization, and I, I think it's worked out pretty well. Um, you know, I never really considered it. I think the big problem for me about restricted plate, or not restricted plate, road courses, is that there's not that much passing that goes on. You don't get much of a chance to have a real, real exciting race. Now, we ended up uh, having this season and last season, we've got the race at Infineon, which has uh, brought about some good finishes, some first-time winners. But uh, we're going to keep that. But I, I don't really think I see the NSR branching out into international tracks like Mexico City and stuff like that. Um, <laughs> well, yeah, actually, I don't know about other NS area members, but, uh, myself, uh, I can recall two times that I actually was eating something while I was commentating the race. It was rather difficult, um, not counting times that I've been chewing gum. Uh, one time I actually was chewing a, a Slim Jim. Uh, I think I actually ended up mentioning during that race that I was chewing a Slim Jim. And the uh, second time, I think it was some kind of, like, a smoked sausage or something, you know, like those really big ones you get, they're kind of like that big, they're like that thick. Yeah, I ended up having one of those during that too, but, uh, uh, I don't know if I gave myself away on that whether I was eating something or not. Well, I can't, I can't say for certain, um, we may end up be staying down here for another week, and, uh, so if that's the case, then the races won't be uploaded until two weeks from now. But, um, you know, as soon as I get to a computer that doesn't have just wireless, I will be uploading, so uh, I'll be sure and let people know that. And in the meantime, I'll keep them updated on what's going on and everything. And uh, So I hope that that's going to help out or something, because, um, you know, I don't know when I'm going to be coming back. And um, when I do, then uh, I'll be uploading videos, and there'll be one right after the other, because I'm already up to week 16, I think, now. May end up, I'll, I'll try, and if I end up staying here another week, I may end up getting the whole season completed and already begin starting on season two, so that'll be really interesting. Oh boy, uh, trying to test my uh, NSRA knowledge. Well, uh, to my knowledge, uh, last season Jake Cole didn't have any truck series wins, and he didn't have any uh, wins, or, or well, no, he didn't have any wins in the Mobile Cup series either. I do know they had three wins last year in the Snickers Cup series, and uh, I don't want to give away if he wins any races, uh, in the races I've done here or not, and uh, just because I said that doesn't mean he actually did win a race, but uh, to my knowledge, up to date with videos that I've uploaded to YouTube, he has three Snickers Cup Series wins. So, uh, hopefully I'm right on that. Well, you know, a, a lot of people have asked me how I've gotten fraps, and, and the big problem for me is I don't right offhand remember what the website was. I have uh, had people ask me, so I've gone back trying to find out where did I find this. I do know the first time that I found fraps, they only allowed me to do certain um, amount of segments. I think it was like a 
five minute segment or something and then I was done. That was like a demo version. I was finally able to find a full version and I honestly do not know where that was that I got it from. Um, I've been trying to look it up to try and find it so that way people that want it can have it. I'm still in the search for it so uh, you know don't give up hope. I may be able to find it but um, as of right now I cannot honestly tell you what the link was to the fraps that I'm using but uh, obviously fraps has helped transform the uh, NSRA and my races due to the fact that uh, the process then, uh, I'll tell you right now, the process then, it was take my video camera, videotape the race, then run that whole race again while burning it onto a DVD, then take the DVD, put it into my computer, and edit it by splitting it into parts, then go into Windows Movie Maker, bring those in, and do the editing, then upload it to YouTube. Now I'm able to do it so much easier, I just run it on fraps, put it to Windows Movie Maker, do the editing, and upload it to YouTube. The video camera transition to television and DVD, and then DVD to computer is eliminated, and it's just made it so much quicker for me to be able to upload races. And I, I'm not sure if many people will remember when I did the NACRA races earlier on. Uh, I think it was actually from the beginning of Season 1 up to the All-Star race of Season 1. Um, it, it took a long time, almost nearly three days, for an S NNSCRA race to come out. Now I'm almost able to upload one every single day, and so it's really cut down the process, but for all of you out there that want to know how to get fraps for free, I, my suggestion is just go out there and search, try to find it, anything you can, because, uh, honestly, I do not remember the download, and I ended up just coming across it by accident, but I will be on the hunt to try and find it for you guys, and if I do find the place that I ended up getting it from, I'll be sure and let you know. Well, obviously, with uh, commentating races, seeing the races week in, week out, I've been able to pretty much assess different drivers. And uh, so Jack Richards, probably what I would say about Jack Richards is that this guy has hit a lot of hard luck. He's, he's an amazing qualifier in both, all three of the series. In uh, the truck series, he's always up there in the top ten for starting if he qualifies for the race. In the uh, Mobile One Cup series, he's up there in the top ten for qualifying position. And the same for the Snickers Cup series. He always seems to be up there at the start. I think the big problem for him is just bad luck seems to come his way. So, uh, Jack Richards, obviously a great driver. I just think that uh, he needs to work on missing the wrecks or something. You know, I don't know if it's that he starts on the outside line most of the time, and so there's nowhere for him to go when a wreck occurs or what. But, uh, obviously the success mostly has been happening over in the uh, Mobile One Cup Series, but with the fact that he's going to be in the chase for the Snickers Cup Series, you know, that, that may be a dark horse. We're not seeing him... Uh, up at the front winning races, and, and that may turn around. Jack Richards may be the dark horse, and who knows? He may end up getting in due to the fact that he finished second in the NSRA NR 2003 contest and take it all and win the Snickers Cup Series Championship. It can be done. Well, I'd have to probably say yes, because even when I'm not actually commentating races, I'm going through my head... What can I say in this area? Uh, how can I make the NNS area a little bit better? How can I make this race a little bit more exciting? Uh, what new features can I add to it? So, for the most part, yeah, for, for most of the time, um, I am working on NNS area races. And uh, then, obviously, I do the commentating, the running of the races, working of uh, the point system right now, which I'm doing. Um, obviously, Amp 88 Go Dale uh, does the point system for the NSRA, but since I'm not able to send him finishing orders and whatnot, I'm down here doing the point system myself right now, but, uh, you know, it, it is a pretty long process to put together a stop motion race, and anybody out there that does uh, the NR2003 things will tell you that. Uh, the weirdest thing I've ever done... I think probably the weirdest thing I've ever done is uh, I, I like putting these videos out so much I ended up once having a sore throat and I commentated four races with a sore throat. I don't know if people actually heard me on the audio thing or not, but uh, that was probably one of the weirdest things I ever did. Um, instead of just uh, letting myself be sick, getting better, I decided I'm still going to do a races and so uh, I ended up commentating four races with a sore throat. Okay, you really want to know what it is that's making all that noise around here? Well, take a look down there. That's Sweetie. She's a German Shepherd down here, and uh, she's really cute. She's uh, wanting me to play with her bolly right now. That's what she calls it. So that's what that's annoying me.